Hey guys, welcome to another vlog. Today we're gonna actually be putting on a decal or a decal onto the Jeep. So uh, I'm gonna show you step by step on how to get the decal onto the back window. There's usually two ways of getting it done. One way is by wetting the surface and the sticker and then positioning it. Depending on the weather and depending on the size of the decal, you would then kind of decide on which way to go. I'm going to explain it right now. If it's a very small decal with the very small letterings, it's better to put it on a dry surface than a wet surface. If it's a bigger decal, it's easier and it's, it would be more advisable to have it on a wet surface. Number two, if it's cold outside, depending on the temperature, uh, you would play it by ear. So because it is a bit cold right now, we're gonna put it on dry. But generally when it's warm, you tend to put it on wet. All right, so we're gonna do the dry application today and we'll do it step by step. So stay tuned. Okay, so the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna clean the surface. I'm gonna use Windex. Some people say it's better to use uh, like just water or water with a bit of mild soap but Windex is made for glass so I don't see the harm in using Windex and so we're gonna Windex the surface over here of the glass to get it totally dust free and clean. Okay, looks pretty clean. I forgot the tape. Tape is very important. If you had a tape, I would actually tape the top to position it, but we're gonna wing it this time. So uh, I'm gonna pull off the backing. The trick is to make sure that the sticker sticks on this side, not on the blue. So just nice and slowly. And if it is, uh, if it isn't sticking, you can give it a bit of a rubbing. There we go, guys. very carefully we're gonna position this where we want to position it this at the corner hopefully it's straight and we're gonna press it against the window now what we're gonna do see if you use water you can still position it. If you found that it was crooked or something, you can still move it around. This is solid, it's on. Usually if you have a squeegee, it's, a, it's the best idea. Uh, but if you're using a credit card or any type of plastic card, you don't want to give as much pressure just because you could move the numbers around and letters around. Uh, downward motion, one motion. And you're also removing any bubbles and any air that has kind of gotten caught between the sticker and the windshield. So kind of giving it a good press and also removing any air bubbles. Because the sticker is so thin, you will not notice as many air bubbles as something that was like maybe solid and more thick. Pull it from one direction here. It's nice and slow. You do not want to rush this. Take it nice and slow because you don't want to screw this up. It's done. 
and that's how you put a decal onto the vehicle. This was a dry version, as in a dry application. Uh, who knows, I might make another video if I do decide to stick something else on with, uh, with a wet application. Hope this was informative, hope this gave you enough motivation to do something on your own. It's definitely easy and I'll definitely suggest doing it on your own and paying someone else to do it for you. Stay tuned for other videos, hit the like, subscribe, share, and we'll see you guys soon.